Hi everyone, my name is François Parlant and today I'd like to show you how to play with colors in Moodle and in a few seconds with just a copy and paste you'll end up with something like that. Let's start now! First, I'd like you to go to the website getbootstrap.com. Actually, you don't have to get it because everything is already included in Moodle. Just click on Docs to get to the documentation and there you have the components. What's really interesting there is that if you choose buttons, you will see that all the buttons have a perfect set of colors and they're called primary, secondary, success, danger, warning, info, light or dark. What it means is that every Moodle site has those color even though the color are not exactly the same because every website, every school chooses a different primary, secondary, success or danger color. But what is great for the teachers is that if you just use those names for your colors in your boxes, your buttons, if you change your activity and put it on another website, it will match perfect, perfectly the harmony of the new website because it will use the new colors for those names. Now, I'd like you to go somewhere else. Now that we've seen the buttons already, I would like you to go to alerts and here you have a light versions and I like to play with that. So just go down, don't do anything, just copy the code and we're going to use that in your Moodle. In your Moodle, find the link Add an Activity or Resource, click on it, and then choose a label. Once you are in the labels, I would like you to click on the arrow going down to show the additional icons and click the last one, which is HTML. Don't worry about the code, erase everything and paste what you've just copied. If you want to see those alerts in action, click again on HTML and here they are. But I would like them to be darker. So click again on HTML and we're going to change something. Instead of the second alert, I would like you to type BG, which is background. And here we are going to have the primary color, the real one. You see, it's a bit darker than the light version of the alert. Let's click again on HTML because the text is not really readable. So at the end of primary, add a space and type text dash white. And now you are going to have a box with the background in real blue and the text in white. You can do that for all the elements in Moodle using Bootstrap. And uh, here you are, you have really vivid colors for your alert, or you can keep the alert versions to have something a bit lighter. In the next video, I'll show you how to play with icons to add a bit of fun uh, to your buttons and your boxes. And we are going to fold or unfold the elements which I love into assignments to give hints to my students. See you soon. Bye bye.